said that the hymn Amazing Grace is the most popular hymn ever written, at least for churches in North America. It's in many of our hymnals, not that people need to see the words. I suspect most of those who grew up going to church have it memorized, or at least the first verse memorized. The message of unconditional love found in the words of the hymn clearly expresses the good news proclaimed by Jesus. The promises of forgiveness and grace can be very healing. The word home in the hymn conjures up images of our heavenly home, which could be one of the reasons why we hear or sing it at funerals. But in our current context, when we find ourselves staying closer to home and in our own backyards, when we travel more to the local parks rather than to some far off destinations, that language of home may resonate differently than it did months ago before the pandemic. Right. And right now, home may feel like the only place we're safe because it's the only place we don't have to worry about masks and being exposed to the virus. Maybe home has come to feel like a prison, a place of solitary confinement with no way of knowing for certain how long we will have to stay there. Maybe home feels scary and dangerous because we are stuck there with people who can and do hurt us. One of the beauties of this hymn is its reminder that life includes dangers, toils, and snares. But in the midst of them all, God is always with us. Listen to these words from Psalm 121. And as I read, listen especially for the repetition of an important key word. Listen to the promise that is articulated again and again with that word. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where does my help come? My help comes from God, who made heaven and earth. God will not let my foot be moved. The one who keeps me will not slumber. The one who keeps Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. 
God is my keeper. God is the shade at my right hand. The sun will not strike me by day, nor the moon by night. God will keep me from all evil. God will keep my life. God will keep my going out and my coming in from this time on and forevermore. The Lord bless us and keep us. The Lord's face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look upon us with favor and give us peace. Amen. Amen. Be safe. Be well. Be assured that God keeps us all in the love of God's hand. I will come to you in the silence. I will lift you from all your fear. You will hear my voice. I claim you as my choice. Be still and know I am here. I am hope for all who are hopeless. I am eyes for all who long to see. In the shadows of the night, I will be your light. Come and rest in me. Do not be afraid, I am with you. I have called you each by name. Come and follow me, I will bring you home. I love you and you are mine. I am strength for all the despairing, healing for the ones who dwell in shame. All the blind will see, the lame will all run free, and all will know my name. Do not be afraid, I am with you. I have called you each by name. Come and follow me, I will bring you home. the world cannot give. I will call your name, embracing all your pain. Stand up, now walk and leave. Do not be afraid, I am with you. I have called you each by name. Come and follow me, I will bring you home. I love you and you are mine. Hey, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to give us a like and even a comment. And please, please, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel.